Hi Aries, this is your November What Do They Think About You reading. This is a general What Do They Think About You reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, this is not for someone who is in a happy, committed relationship. This is also not for someone who is not on your radar, you're not on their radar, and they don't know you exist. If they don't know that you exist, then this reading is not for you. This is someone who is your love interest. They know who you are. You know who they are. And um, we want to know what they are thinking about you. If this resonated and you want to go further into detail or it sounds like your situation, um, information to book a reading with me is down below. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay. Okay, so bottom of the deck we have Knight of Cups. That's that's always a great sign. So you might have have your love interest um following their heart, maybe rushing in to offer you some love, their cup of love, okay? So let's go ahead and see what the cards say. So what they show you, like how does this person present themselves to you? What do they show you? What are you being shown? Oh, so you don't think right now they're not offering like any hints about love to you right now. You feel like they don't want to make things happen with you. You feel like they don't want um, to move forward with you. They're not giving you any emotion, any love. So right now, you are kind of not, per se, being left out of the cold. But right now, you really feel that this person is not interested in you. Okay? But let's see how they, what they think of you. Okay? Okay. Wow. So we have nine of swords, um, but it's reversed. Wow. So, okay, this was probably, um, this relationship probably you guys were in a relationship and you have been going through some things. Right now they feel um, you guys encountered some problems in your relationship and they're coming out of this despair energy. They're, they were up in their heads, pretty anxious about what's been going on between the two of you but they are coming out of it um and they are considering reaching out to you but there's still some anxiety there okay but it's in reverse so there is hope there okay so how they see you is that they haven't lost hope in you so right now you're viewing them as not wanting to go forward with them and they haven't lost hope yet okay um all right, so let's see what they think about you as a whole. So right now, they feel that you are not trying to make things happen with them. So they see that you're not reaching out to them. You're not offering your love to them. Um, and it's just really, really, really... Um, slow but because this is in reverse um this tells me there could be a slight obsession um obsessiveness about you so when the knight of pentacles is in reverse yes it could mean like an offer is not coming in or a slow offer is not coming in but it also can sometimes signify like an obsessiveness so i feel like you are on their mind aries and I feel that they haven't lost hope with this relationship, okay? Okay, and something that attracts them to you. 
Okay, so they see that you're a hard worker. They see that you're very dedicated. They see that you're about your business and they see that you're about your money. And they find this incredibly attractive. They love that you're a hard worker. They love that you're willing to do whatever it is necessary to succeed. So that's one great attribute that they really see in you. Something that turns them off about you. <laughs> okay. So we have the two of wands in reverse. Um, they feel like you're not making a choice and you're trying to play it safe. So they feel that not maybe you didn't choose them, but they feel like you're not making a choice in life. And that's part of the reason why this whole relationship is stalled. So they feel like not that you're like a bad planner, but they feel like you never took a stance in this relationship. And that's why they're in their head. But they do feel like there is hope. Even though they're not showing you any any sign of that right now. And what's this going to pan out to? Like, are they going to pursue you? Like, how much, how interested are they in, in you? What's What's going to happen? Well... They do have fond memories of you and six of cups. Um, they know that you're a good person. They have great memories with you. And this also for me tells you that they do want to heal this relationship. And they do possibly want a reconciliation. Okay. It's just for the time being. Um, they're in their heads. You think they don't want to offer you anything. They feel that you don't want to offer them anything. And it's just at a complete standstill, Aries. Okay. So let's go ahead. I want to pull a romance angel for you. Angels. What can you offer advice to my Aries? Sun, moon, rising Venus for this person. What advice can you give them about this relationship for their highest good and clarity? I have... Um, I actually have all, it could be anyone uh, that you're dealing with. I have all sign, I have all elements on the layout, but more so earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but I do have cup, I have sword, and I have wand, so it could be anyone, okay? And I did not get any major arcanas, so... Okay, what advice can we give to our lovely Aries, our beautiful, beautiful, amazing Aries? What clarity can we offer them about this specific relationship? Oh, nothing's coming out. What should Aries know? All right, nothing's coming out. So three more shuffles. One, two, three. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. So I feel like this is appropriate in this specific situation because right now you both are at a complete standstill. Um, you know, they're in the partner, your partner Aries is in their heads about you and you feel like they don't want to offer you anything when in reality they do. I just feel like right now what is best for the both of you is just to retreat and really contemplate what the next move is. Does this person mean enough to you for you to make a move? Do you mean enough to them where they will come to you and try to make it right? Right now, I feel like you just need to put it in the universe's hands and right now concentrate on yourself. And if this is meant to be, 
it will come back for you. This relationship will come back to you, okay? All right, Aries, take care. See you next time.